What's up guys? So David actually commented this puzzle on one of my videos and I saw it and plugged it into the analysis board here and it looks pretty interesting. So what I'm gonna do is see if I can solve it myself first and then we'll turn on Stockfish and see what Stockfish has to say and we'll go through the solution. So if you'd like to pause before I start talking about what I'm thinking about, uh, this is the position. It's white to play. Take note of the fact that we are in check. Our pawns are going this way. White to play. And what do you think the winning idea is for white? Go ahead and take a look at that. And then I'll talk through what I'm thinking about. All right. So first of all, thank you, David, for sending in this uh, position. It looks pretty interesting and, and fun. I kind of see the point right away here. And so we'll see if I can actually solve it, though. So the idea is that if I take the rook, the obvious move, it's a stalemate because black can't move the king. The pawn can't move. And so we don't want to take the rook. The problem is, like, let's just say I move my king. Well, the rook can just go next to my king and just keep checking me. And if I ever take it, it's stalemate. So I have to figure out, is there a way that I can get out of the checks so that I can, you know, finish off the game with, with a checkmate like this or something, right? So I'm thinking, you know, if I block, of course, the rook's just going to take. And I could keep blocking, but the rook is just going to keep taking my pawns. So that doesn't really make sense. I could try to run this way, but again, the rook's going to check me. I could try to run back here. It's going to check me, and I have to take it. So that doesn't work either. If I run up here, again, it's probably just going to check me. I have one idea. I have one idea. But I don't know exactly how to make it work. But I feel like if I run this way, and eventually like somehow come up here to where the rook has to check me, where I can take it and deliver checkmate... That might solve my problems. That might solve my problems. Or if I could somehow, yeah, no, if I could somehow like sacrifice a pawn at the same time as putting it here, but no, I don't think that would work. So let's just say, let's just start with this move and see what happens. Like, let's just say black goes here and I run this way. And black goes, and it could go either way, but I'm just going to follow this path for now and see what happens. They could, if they take us, that, that's bad. Then we just win automatically because there's no more stalemate. You don't have to worry about it. Oops, sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Um, so here, I got the new main line. Um, all right, so if I go here, there's still this check. See, this almost works, right? Like, this is what I'm thinking. I just take it and I win. The problem is the rook doesn't have to do that. It can go over here. If I run this way and it gets here, I still have the same problem. It just keeps checking me. If I run here, I could run here, but then it's going to do this, and I don't really see a way to do that. Okay. So this doesn't work. This doesn't work. So let's go back. Is there any way that I can like use this idea but put a twist on it? Like, what if I maybe sacrifice one of these pawns first and maybe, like, run this way and run around or just something that changes the outcome is what I'm thinking. I don't know. Like, let's let's just say, hypothetically, I did this pawn. The rook takes it. Okay, fine. Now I come this way. The rook has to come this way because it gives me, like, a new path. I don't know if that changes anything. Let's see. Does that change anything? Maybe I run this way. Does that change anything? If I run up, the rook could chase me this way. So I got here. Um, not really seeing it. I could throw in another pawn sacrifice. Yeah, I'm not really seeing a way out of this. Hmm. And then why is there a random rook over here? Like, can I do something with the rook? What if I did like this pawn and this pawn? And then I started trying to run like this. Does this do anything? I don't think so, but maybe. Let's see. What if I run... 
Hmm. Let's say this way. There, check, 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 check. I'm not really seeing it, guys. I thought, yeah, this this isn't working right. All right, uh, David, good puzzle. I think I'm gonna have to turn on Stockfish. Yeah, I don't. Let me let me just think one more time. One more time. Any any ideas here? Any more ideas? I could go this way and then like sacrifice one of these pawn. No, but he could even come over here. And then what? What am I even doing? I don't know. I don't. I don't see it. As soon as I see the answer, I'm gonna be like, ah, oh, why didn't I think of that? Of that. All right, stockfish. What do we have? Stockfish says mate in eighteen. E three is the move. I did say that. C3, I did say that. King A2, I said that. Okay, so I was on the right track. I guess I just missed the final idea. Okay, okay. This is what I did. Okay, all right. King F4, oh, I was close, guys. I feel, I feel better. King F3, or take G3. Oh, king to E2? How does going back help rookie three check king d1 rookie one check king c2 rook c1 check king b3 still don't see the idea how am i not seeing the idea oh <laughs> oh i see that rook you know, remember that rook yes I was thrown off by this, and I, I forgot to think about these other ideas. Uh, that's, okay, that's good. I like that. I like that. Thank you, David. Oh, man. All right, yeah. Very cool. That was fun. Uh, I, I'm not going to lie. That was a lot of fun. Like, it's such a weird idea, right? Like, push the pawns, run your king, like this, and what do we do? Something like this, and over here, and then... Back this way again, and then check me with the rook. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed that. Let me know if you solved it. Thanks again, David. Appreciate that. If you guys have any more of these crazy puzzles like this, you can email them or comment them. Maybe I'll see it. Email is, is a little bit better. But um, maybe don't just send me like random positions from your games that had like a mate in one. Uh, you know, like make it like actually interesting if you can. Um, but anyway, thank you guys. And uh, I'll see you next time. Stay sharp. Play smart. Take care.